hi everyone so this video will show you procedure of cracking check under chapter 4 part 2 for reinforced concrete beams so we start so in Eurocode crack checking can be referred in Eurocode part 1 1 2004 in clause 7.3.3 Okay, Eurocode Part 1, 2004. So, in that clause, clause uh, you will find table 7.2n and also 7.3n in page 123. That table will be used to check the allowable bus spacing or the allowable maximum bus size okay so before using that table you need to calculate the style the steel stress for limiting crack width so i show you the table inside the uh, euro codes one hundred one two three one two three page one two three so this is the table Okay, this is the table. So this is a uh, table 7.2n for the maximum bar diameter. And next is this is table 7.3n maximum bar spacing. So basically we use this one for the bar spacing. Okay, then we select the crack width here is 0 0.3. So we will use 0 0.3 for both table. And then this is again. This is our our crack width is limited to zero point three in all exposure cases. Okay, under quasi permanent combination of load. Okay, we use zero point three mm for table seven point two newton. Eh, sorry, seven point two and table seven point three. Okay, to use this table, we start with the steel stress. Okay, this steel stress for both table is calculated via this equation okay so the first one is this equation or you use this equation okay and this lambda is determined during flexure reinforcement design if you still remember in my previous video so fun for non redistribution moment lambda is equal to one okay for non redistribution moment meaning no redistribution moment so this lambda is equal to one okay or you can use this equation then after the steel stress is calculated then we can apply it in table 7.2n and 7.3n to determine the maximum bar spacing and also the maximum bar diameter and but however basically we will use table 7.3 we will do the uh, checking using the bar spacing okay so under 0.3 mm correct width the limited is 0.3 millimeter okay so next after calculate the steel stress then we refer to table 7.3 or 7.2 in page 123 euro code part 11 2004 so 7.3 n table 7.3 n is for the allowable bar spacing meanwhile for the maximum bar size is from table 7.2 Basically, we refer to this table for crack checking. Next, after we determine the allowable bus spacing from this table, next we do the adequate crack control. Okay. We must make sure that our crack checking is okay when the spacing provided is less than maximum spacing so s is the spacing okay the provided spacing is smaller than 
maximum spacing. This maximum spacing is determined from table 7.3n and the uh, provided spacing is based on our cross section. For example, this cross section, let's say there are six tensile reinforcement uh, uh, tension reinforcement at the uh, tension area so this is the S the provided S okay the provided S so this provided S the equation is S equal to B this is our B the width of the beam okay the width of the beam minus this is our link shear reinforcement so we have both sides shear reinforcement b minus shear reinforcement two diameter link minus This is concrete cover, okay, minus 2C, 2 concrete cover, 1, 2, meaning B minus this one and this one minus concrete cover this part and also link, shear reinforcement link here, minus The main diameter, the main diameter divided by two. So we have this is the set. We have half here, half of the diameter, half the diameter. So this is the one diameter minus two divided by two. Sorry, divided by two because there are two side. Okay, this is one spacing and one spacing. And this S is the S provided. Provided. Okay. For example, for this case, let's say this is the case. Only two reinforcement. And this is the shear link. And this is the width of the beam. So the S provided is equal to B minus concrete cover minus diameter of the shearling 2 because there are two sides. Okay, so this is our S minus diameter of the main reinforcement. So only one S, so no need to divide it by 2. Okay, so S provided is depends on the arrangement of the steel reinforcement. So that's all for the cracking checking. Make sure the S provider is less than the maximum spacing. The maximum provide the spacing provider is less than the maximum spacing, uh, which uh, the maximum spacing is determined from table seven point three. Okay, that's all for the crack checking. Thank you.